Hi, my name is Dr. Alan. I'm a GP at Burley Health Centre. So we're just taking a bit of time to meet some of the staff um, so you can better understand the role that they do uh, and get to know them a little bit better. So we've got today Jo, one of our receptionists. I'm just going to uh, have a quick chat to her. So here's Jo. Hi. So tell me a bit about the reception role and particularly about maybe how it's changed as well. The reception role, we're all a fairly new team and we all work very well together. Mm. There's various different parts to the reception role. It's not just about answering the telephone. We have a lot of um, admin work regarding people's test results and referrals of where they're going and where it is in the system. We also um, order all the repeat prescriptions as well, whether that be online, by email or over the phone. So it's quite a varied role altogether. It's also changed now because we've got a, um, something in place called care navigation. So that is where if um, you need something that's a minor ailment, there's different options for you to take. We can refer you through to the pharmacist because a lot of the pharmacists now can uh, do referrals. They can issue uh, minor ailments for such as bites, rashes, anything like that. They can do all that sort of medication. You don't have to see a doctor, so it keeps the doctor free for more of emergency patients. Mm -hmm. Obviously, if you have been to hospital or you've been... Uh, contact through 111 or through accident and emergency. All that information is sent through to the reception team and if you need to see the doctor, that all goes through to the doctor for him to have a look at your information and then obviously contact you for an appointment. If not, we just put all that information onto your files as well. Yeah. We also deal on a daily basis with the registration of patients um, new patients coming into the surgery, the incoming uh, records, where we get all those put onto the system as well. Yeah. So as you can see, it is quite a varied role. So what, what's it like working on reception? Reception is a very, very busy area. There is really no let-up at all between the phones, the patients coming into the surgery and the admin. It is a full-on job from the minute we open the doors to the minute we close. There is never a second of spare time at all. What's it, what's it like doing the job? How do you the find job it? is, although it's very busy, it is very, very good because it's very rewarding. You can help a lot of people and you can do a lot of good, even if they just want somebody to talk to. Even though we haven't got time always, we always make the time. You can tell as soon as they ring up that they're not themselves. They just need to get something off the chest. And the main thing is for us to listen, give them a bit of hope and a little bit of encouragement and perhaps send them in a different direction if it's something they need help over. And we can advise them all about that. Mm. And what do you find most challenging about the role? One of the most challenging things is we get a minority of a patient who are abusive to us. At the end of the day, we are all here to help you. The whole team is, and the, all the team work together. And obviously, when people get very irate and very abusive, it's not helping the situation. We just want to do what we can for you and help you and do the best we can to support you, whether it's through an illness, sickness, referral, or just ordering a prescription. Mm. And what, what do you most enjoy? What's, what's like the best bits of your, of your role? Um, I do enjoy being on the phone with the patient, mm -hmm. especially mm -hmm. when you know you can help them. Mm -hmm. Obviously, we can't help everybody all the time, but it's the gratitude you get, mm -hmm. over, even over a small thing, and the patients are just so grateful, mm -hmm. and you know that you've made their day for them just mm -hmm. by doing a simple task, yeah. and that makes you feel good. And, and what's your background? So how did you get into this? I worked for John Lewis Partnership for 35 years and obviously as many people know um, we went into redundancy and I wanted to look at different avenues to help in other areas and I thought the NHS was a good option to go down because I've got a lot of 
experience both in customer service and background and admin work so it was bringing everything together and in three weeks time I'll have been here 12 months and I don't know where that 12 months has gone <laughs> it's absolutely flown yeah great thanks Joe. so yeah the reception team really do a remarkable job and I think the thing that they the way that I kind of describe it is they organize the work that, in, that, that comes in and in the past I would just be giving people appointments um, whereas now it re there's there's more work than we than we can do realistically, and so we have to work out how do we organise that work. And the bit that's really key that is reception gather a bit of information for us, um, and then we can use that information to work out who's the best person to see them and what level of urgency do we need to see them. And that helps us to organise um, the incoming work, and that means that you're far more likely to get the help that you need. And yeah, it's a, it's a tough work environment, but we have a really caring bunch of receptionists and that makes such a difference. Uh, and it's really nice to hear Joe's story. All right, thank you.